Hello YouTube, Marauders here and I have here the Minix Z64. So while it looks like the one of another one of the numerous Android set top boxes you can find in the market, this is actually a bit special because it runs uh, Windows 8.1. So there's an Atom Z3735F in here. So it basically has the same performance as the numerous other tablets I've reviewed before like the Acer 8W and the Joy 8. So I'm not actually here to do a review about this device today. <clears throat> I'm actually here to talk about a interesting little problem you might run into if you have the, if you are trying to use this thing on HDMI. So the problem which I'm going to talk about is that you just finished installing finishing the setup of the of the Neo C64, you've entered Windows and you and you realize that you have no sound. You go into the sound test, you tap, you toggle the thing, you can see that there's supposed to be some sound but you can't hear anything. So what's happening is that the audio isn't being outputted through the HDMI port. If you, so what you have to do is you have to turn on the set HDMI to become your default audio output device. So you go in here, you go to playback devices, and then you will see two audio devices, hopefully, if nothing's wrong. This is the internal, this is the normal audio jack, and this is the HDMI port. You will see one thing as an extra for the HDMI. So you select this, press set default, OK, and now you can go back to the audio and you get sound. So that's just a quick video on solving the little audio problem that you might be getting from the Minix Neo Z64.